Welcome back to another episode. So today I got me a brand new JBL Flip 5. Now I've been really impressed, really impressed with JBL Bluetooth speakers. I actually did two reviews on a uh, Go 3 and a Clip 3. Yeah, 3, 3. Um, and they have been uh, amazing. Like sound quality, it's, you know, you, you can't, you can't expect much out of small speakers like that. But the build quality of those things are just phenomenal. It's one of the best build quality in tech that I've ever seen. So today, I got me a Flip 5 to test out. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. I'm like, I'm super excited about the sound quality of this thing. I can't wait to uh, hear it thump. You got yourself a box. I'm assuming is a box of accessories, but look at this thing. This is, uh, this looks like it's made from recycled material. It looks like it, but look at the packaging. Come on. How can you not love this thing? It even says JBL on here. And here it is guys. This is the flip. I think I know why they call it the flip. I think it's because you can go like this or like this. It doesn't matter which way you go. I, I believe that's the reason why they call it the flip. But we're going to have to call JBL to, to ask about that. Uh, so then, anyway, let's take a look at this box right here. I don't like just miscellaneous box sitting around. Okay, so we got a quick start guide. We got instruction manual. The safety manual for a Bluetooth speaker. Look how thick this thing is, guys. This is... Okay, just have a few cords. Oh, just one cord. Not a few cords. Okay, so can I just mention this? I saw this on like the... Um, I, I believe it was the Go. Their USB cord is like a little orange. You see that? <laughs> I don't know. It's just, it's just beautiful because the, obviously, right? It's got to match with the logo, the orange. So it looks like the lanyard is already installed on here, but pretty easy to take out if you want to. By the way, I, yes, I did get the, the four screen one, okay? I'm old school. So it looks like both sides is, um, is the base module. And look how small this thing is. I was actually expecting it to be a little bit bigger than uh, it is in my hand. It, it's, uh, I mean, the picture looks pretty big, to be honest with you. But that's pretty small. All right, so anyway, buttons. Uh, you got yourself literally just two buttons on top right here to turn on and Bluetooth. Uh, charger uh, port right here, USB-C. By the way, did I mention USB-C? It's uh, actually a fast charge USB-C. So I, I, I like that a lot. That's very nice. And then we got ourselves some uh, you know nice media controls right here, which is kind of a classic. I don't know how they're doing this. They're always like integrating it in with the mesh Bluetooth speakers. So it feels so nice and integrated. Look at that. I don't know how they're doing it. And these are physical buttons, guy. These are like, if you press it, you can feel it. Did you hear that? You can feel it. They're physical buttons. I don't know how they're doing it, integrating it into the mesh too. All right, so I think the moment of truth is, um, how does it sound? How does something like this sound? All right, here we go. First, let's go ahead and turn it on. Do I just press the button once or hold it? Just press the button once. I'm going into my Bluetooth, and yep, Flip 5 shows up right away. So boom. <laughs> Yeah, how, how loud is this volume? Let me see here. Okay, so I have my volume halfway, all right? I have the mic like right on top right here. I'm gonna put it right in the middle. So the mic right on top right here. I'm gonna play something from Spotify real quick.
Okay, so right there, um, that's half way volume. All right, now I'm gonna turn it up all the way, full blast, and I'm gonna restart the song again. All right, now remember, this song here I always use because it, it starts off really low, and then, and then that bass hit. And that's when you know how good the speakers are. All right, so anyway, I'm gonna turn it this way. It's called a flip, so gotta flip it, right? Yeah, anyway. All right, full volume this time. Restart. Okay, all right. So that right there is the JBL Flip 5 right there. All right, so my opinion, um, it is not 360 surround sound, okay? So uh, it's, let me just explain. The speakers, it's like right in the front right here, okay? So even though the design is like wrap around design, the speakers are like right in the front. You can definitely tell when I'm turning this direction to this direction. Uh, it's, it's a lot louder. It's, it's firing straight in my face. So the bass module, I feel like it could be a bit stronger. It didn't rock my table. I guess that's, uh, that's the key right there. Some of the other Bluetooth speakers that I've used, uh, it, it did rock the table. This one didn't. So it looks like they're controlling the bass here a little bit more. The uh, front firing speakers, it's, it's super loud. I mean, I can't, I can't even listen to this thing on full blast sitting right here. If you're wondering if this, since this, the design is kind of like a, uh, a cylinder design, if it's gonna stay on the table, it does. Look at this, it actually like, the way they've designed it, um, the, it's kind of heavy, I guess, on the back right here, where if I go, if I leave it like this, it just rolls and stay in place. I don't know how to do it. You know that you want JBL because of their quality. And that right there, those little things right there is what some of the other manufacturer can't match, is they think about the little things like that, including it being cylinder and I let go and it just, falls into place. I don't know. I don't know. They, they, they've just thought about it, you know? Anyway, that's my first impression on this. I feel like it's a really good speaker for at a good price. Um, su surprisingly loud for something this small. I thought it would be a lot bigger actually in picture. Anyway, guys, that's it for me right there. That's the JBL Flip 5. I hope you guys enjoy that. Have a good one.